This will be a 10 minute guided meditation. And the idea of a meditation uh, would be that it's a, it's an intentional practice to build skills of awareness in the mind. Just like we exercise our bodies, uh, we can exercise the mind to be more effective. And one of the ways that the mind can be less effective in the world is that the reactive mind can start to take over. The reactive mind is the mind that tries to control, it tries to organize, it tries to fix everything, <laughs> fix things by, by doing. And that works well in a number of circumstances. But there's a lot of circumstances where trying to control things that we don't have control over uh, just causes more stress. And when we practice mindful meditation, we slow things down so that we can start to wake up. We can start to become more aware. And there's a, an awareness that we can start to tap into, an awareness we can practice coming back to consistently that is a wider awareness that is more than just the mind of thoughts. Because when we're not practiced at having an open, aware mind, our mind will automatically collapse into autopilot, which is being pulled around by our thoughts. And it's a reactive mind. It's a mind that gets stressed out when things are not in control, when things don't go our way. And this is an awesome realization because there is a sense of fulfillment, a sense of safety and calmness that can be here even when things are hard. And especially when things are good, really being able to take in the good. So let's take the next 10 minutes to practice a meditation that will exercise the mind to open up to relax, to open and become more aware. So start by whether you're on a chair or a cushion, just having an upright and alert spine. And closing the eyes or just casting the eyes downward. And there's no real intention to feel anything in particular. There's no agenda to have an, a special experience right now. So let's just see if we can give our bodies that permission to kind of just soften, to relax the body a little bit. Without needing to get anywhere in particular, we can have permission to just notice, be aware of what's already here. So feel into this body right now. Where What's it feel like in this face? What's it feel like at the top of the head? Is there a permission you can give yourself to soften, to slow down? And maybe begin to notice what it feels like in this chest. What's it like here in this belly? Can the torso region, can the chest and the belly just soften with each in-breath, soften with each out-breath? There's a habitual tension that we hold often. And when we soften, we not only send a signal to ourselves that it's safe right here in this moment, but we can also start to become more aware of what this body is holding, what sensations are here behind the armor. And just noticing the points of contact between this body and this chair, this cushion. And then maybe taking in the entire body, just noticing what sensations arise as this body inflates 
with the breath. And what's the experience as the body deflates? And this curious awareness, this very simple, curious awareness of just these experiences that are happening right now in this moment, it's not trying to fix anything. It's not controlling anything. There's nothing to be done here. It's just resting with what is. Curiously noticing what's happening right now. And what's the experience right now? And rather than trying to notice the thoughts about the experience of right now, see if you can just really tune into just the experience of these sensations as this breath comes in or as this breath goes out. If you get caught up in thoughts, it's not a problem. It happens to everyone, totally normal. But just see if you can pause once you notice you're caught in a story. And pause with some patience, with acceptance, and just maybe notice what's been happening. The story about your next meal. Is it planning for something that's going to happen later today? Is it worrying? Just give a nice little label. Worrying, planning, remembering. And then see if you can just patiently come back. See if you can get a sense of here-ness, of now-ness, maybe the sounds that are here right now. And then gently make your way back to just this breath, using the breath as your anchor. The mind pulls you away with a thought a hundred times. It's just gently noticing, gently coming back a hundred times. Each time you come back, that's the actual practice. Like reps in the gym. We just notice and we open back up to an awareness that's bigger than just thoughts. just the experience of this breath and of this breath. And if our mind has been particularly busy, it's not a problem. Having thoughts is not your fault. It's just what the mind does. The mind secretes thoughts, just like the mouth secretes saliva. But there's an awareness. There's a bigger awareness here that can practice patience, practice kindness of this busy mind. So the last part of this meditation, just see if you can let those thoughts pass like cars in the street without having to get caught up in slowing them down or stopping them. Just see if you can be like someone that's on a bench, 
just observing, just noticing all the things that are happening around them. And gradually in your own time, slowly make your way back into the room and just see if you could pause a little bit. Maybe the next 30 seconds, just pausing and taking in this scene, this place that you're in right now, right here. <laughs> 